So now that the Demon King has a proper boss in-game, I thought it would be fun to go ahead and use every single Meliodas against him from worst to best. I'm evaluating the quality of the Meliodas based on the fight. Given that he's green, I'm gonna be, you know, prioritizing saying that the red ones would be doing better over the blue ones, for example. Silly mistake, uh, this fight does not actually care for attribute, and I do realize that uh, in this video at some point, but uh, forgive me for this. But we're starting off here with SR Meliodas. I went ahead and 100 every single Meliodas uh, that wasn't 100 already, because this fight is kind of hard, so we'll see how it goes. First turn, actually got a double rank up, so it's pretty nice. The way I'm doing this, I wanted to have basically as much of the damage possible come only from the Meliodas. So I don't want to use like Asterosa, uh, you know, if I'm using like Trader Mali by the end, which would definitely be the last one, right? Oh, I forgot this Meliodas has no taunt. <laughs> no, please AoE. Okay, thank you. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that's not bad. That was like uh, almost too... I was a little scared there for a second. Those almost two um, squares there. So I went ahead. Oh, he's already ulting. That counter meant nothing. Like I only countered once. What the hell? Um, and I went for a build here that basically all my damage is going to come from Meliodas. Like Gaffer is boosting whatever the Meliodas that I'm going to be using. Uh, and then Liz is here to heal. Because again, I this fight is kind of challenging. I wouldn't say it's... I forgot I had ults on. It's fine. I'll let it play this time. I, I, I won't play it for the next ones. Um, okay, I have the healing card set. Because now he debuffs a lot. I, I've done the fight already, of course. When I did story for the first time. Ooh, Galfer. Stand there. Stand back. Maybe I should have given Galfer uh, the Tarmiel link. I gave Liz the Tarmiel link, but Galfer has type neutral. Liz is type advantage. Let's do this. Oh, let's ult first, actually. Because then this will give me an ultimate gauge. How much is the ultimate doing? SR Meliod is the best. Oh, the ults are off. Does, does the Demon King ultimate always play? What? Because that ultimate was off. Well, that, that's weird. Okay. I guess his ultimate always plays. I, I didn't even notice though when I was playing. Um, should be fine. Okay. Not gonna lie. From memory, I recall taking more damage than this. Maybe it's because I'm using the healing card set. And I'm healing every hit. It might be helping, alright. Let it, let us end with the level 3 counter. Um, hopefully. Hopefully he won't just one-shot. I don't think he one-shots with the ultimate. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. I want to end it with the level 3 counter. That wasn't too bad. Uh, it was very slow. Very slow. So I'm hopeful that all that would change from the other release that would, would just be faster, right? Because he, he actually has quite a bit of health. Oh, he has weak point! Well, that's my fault. <laughs> he would have killed! That's alright. Bond will take care of it. You have to bring a Bon. Uh, so I chose, you know, Ragnarok Bon in the back would be my best option. And okay, now that I'm thinking about it, maybe this should have been the first one. I mean, I should have used Blue Demon. Now, with Blue Demon Melee, I'm not going to use Gaffer. I'm going to use uh, Lilia. But maybe this guy should have been my first one. The Blue Captain Melee, the SSR one, he is awful. Let's do this and see his damage. <laughs> He's critting. Okay, the Demon King has, like, no core resistance. That's nice. If we can proc an ultimate for him, he'll be okay. Ooh, level 3. Level 3 for Meliodas. That'll be fine. Yeah, the healing card side is kind of cracked, because every, every attack... Maybe I should take it. No! He, he attack sealed. Uh... <laughs> uh... Uh... Oh no, his ultimate is not weak point. It's a shock. Why did he one-shot me that time? I actually don't know what his passives and stuff are. 
I'm gonna rank up Meliodas and hope next turn I'm not Taxiled. Maybe I should have brought Cleanse Unit. Not Liz. I brought Liz because of the passive heal. Maybe I should have brought Cleanse Unit. Okay, I have to watch this ultimate every time. Really? God damn it. <laughs> Just don't tax me, please. If it taxes me, I'll bring a cleanse character. I'll, I'll retry. No! That's not for one, please. God damn it. Yeah, I was gonna bring Margaret, uh, but I'm just gonna use Glocks. Glocks is a, a nice happy medium, because he cleanses and he heals. And of course his grace doesn't work in PvE, so we're, we're good. We're not gonna be a tackle lord or anything. Okay, he missed a crit that time. Oh. That's... That's really bad. That's... I mean, there, there's a reason why I'm using him second here, but... That's really bad. <laughs> that's terrible damage. The healing card set should cover for that passive heal I wanted. We should be okay. No, uh, no attack seal this time? Okay, of course. When I bring the cleanse character, there's no attack seal. Uh, let's go for his ultimate. Um, that might be a attack seal. We'll see. Let's go for his ultimate. And then, uh, if he attacks us me next time, we'll cleanse. Oh my god. He, okay, he, he, he might actually be worse than the SR Melee. I, I, I might have been mistaken. SR Melee should have been maybe third. I, maybe I should have done him, or th like this guy, then Blue Demon Melee. I've just watched this every single time. Because Blue Demon Melee, you know, he has an AoE skill, so he's not going to do the best. That actually... Jeez. Uh, we'll cleanse. It's gonna be good, because uh, we cleanse the shock as well. Um, I'm not very confident on the melee damage this time. But let's do this, and we can rank up next turn. We took a lot this time. And we don't have passive here anymore. Like, I didn't need passive heal last time, because I was mostly using counters. Or I didn't, have, didn't need cleanse, sorry, not last time. Because of the counters and stuff. Okay, we have two options. <laughs> um, we rank up melee for damage. Or, we double rank up glocks and mega heal. And I think the correct decision is very easy here. <laughs> Like, listen, this melee sucks. The heal is more valuable. And we're gonna be immune now, so. Bro, this melee is getting care. Why did he heal so much? Can I just give up? I think, I think, uh, I'm just gonna move on to the next one. Like, this melee sucks, man. This melee sucks so bad. Why, why is he even an, a unit? It, it's really questionable that he's even a character in the game. He came out recently, you know? He came out recently. He is technically the most recent melee in this video. And he's the worst. How does that make any sense whatsoever? Thank you, Glocks. Listen, this might be cheating, all right? But I'm bringing Lilia. Because, you know, these should come as a pair, alright? If I'm bringing Meliodas, I have to bring Lilia. L let me do him a really nice solid and let him have this. So let's do this. Let's see the damage that he does with level 3 Pierce card with Lilia and Galfer. A and Bond's giving him Pierce as well, so... But it is an AoE card. Oh, <laughs> okay. It's an AoE card, I was about to say, so I'm not expecting the most damage, but I'll, I was expecting like maybe 40% of his HP. Um, maybe I should have saved those rank ups. We'll be okay. Let's, let, okay, we, we have we have takeoff ultimate gauge now. That's actually pretty cracked. We're gonna do this. Level 3 corrosion is not gonna do anything because he's immune, so that's a great waste of a card right there. But it's fine, because now... Oh, you can't remove his ultimate gauge either. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, hmm. That's fine. That's fine. We can... Uh... We can heal and cleanse the shock. Then attack with melee. 
Yeah, we took a lot there. He doesn't have level 3s, does he? Surely not. Ooh, Melly's taking a lot. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna uh, rank up, because... Uh, no, I think I will. So we can full heal. Okay. Oh, Melly. You are rough, buddy. With Lilia, I, I have her full pierce. Okay. Gaffer's passive is ramping up, so he's gonna start doing more damage, I guess. Slightly more pierce. Okay, cool. That's not an attack seal, I think. Yeah. Um, how much pierce do you have, buddy? Let's take a look. 172. I mean, that's not the most, but... Um, I... I gave up. So I only ulted with Glocks there, because I gave up. I don't want to ult with Gaffer, because I, I still haven't given up for Melly. I think he, he can still do it. I, I gave up for the other one. That's why I ulted with Glocks. Like, if I ult here with Gaffer, I think I win. Oh, jeez. Gaffer's attack is doing, like, half of uh, Melly's damage, so... Always a good sign. I mean, fact, Melly does have type disadvantage, but... His attack crit, so... Gaffer is HP defense. How is he alive? This is so sad. Right, we're starting to ramp up now. We, we got a Halloween melee. We have type advantage, so... I can't believe, though, that... <laughs> counter melee, the SR counter melee, did better than these frauds. The <laughs> Captain Melee and Blue DM Melee. I won't blame Blue DM Melee that much. It's... One enemy, so... Oh, that... Okay. Am I... No melee cards? Am I, um... Am I wrong? I feel like I should have put SR melee over all of these. They're doing way worse than SR melee. What is this? I mean, Halloween melee... I thought, you know, he has type advantage, so... He should... Do all right. Seems like not. Um, it's okay, we get cards for him this turn. And we'll do mega damage, because every single turn that passes... Okay, we got one. Every single turn that passes, right? This melee is building up the crit chance, so... Hmm. Does he ignore typing? And I just don't know that? I just, I think he does. I think he does. I think he does. Was I... Was I mistaken the whole time? I didn't even check beforehand. Oh, he does not. He just... He just got one shot with type advantage. But I'm moving on, like, he just got one shot. The other ones didn't. Like, SR Melly did not get one shot. Okay, I'm gonna have to say in the beginning of the video. Because, you know, I, I, listen, I play JP, okay? I don't read this. But this says, there's no attribute advantage or disadvantage. Mmm. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I'll keep as is. Um, but, yeah, I, SR Melly is definitely above the, uh, the ones. Okay. My list doesn't change, though, because uh, I think other than Sarmeli, which should have been actually better than all the other guys, this one was definitely the worst, regardless of attribute. Um, Blue Day Melee was probably the next one to be worse, regardless, because of one enemy debuff doesn't even work. And this guy was probably next anyways. Or maybe he was worse than Blue Day Melee. I don't know. As Sarmeli, though, above all of them. Crazy. Actually crazy. Moving on to the, the greatest in the game, Green Demon Meliodas. Uh, not, bro, I'm so low confidence on all these characters now. They're all getting slapped up. Let, let's rank up Melee and do his uh, AoE. I'm going to save for a level 3 single target. They're all getting slapped up now. The only one that didn't get slapped up was SR Meliodas. <laughs> uh, you know, Demons, I'm pretty sure... I, I mean, listen, I can't read the passives properly. Demons do less damage to him, and take more damage from him, I'm pretty sure. 
But, you know, SR Melee is still a demon, so that doesn't excuse the other ones from getting shit on by SR Melee, which did better than everyone else. Unbelievable. Let's rank him up. I'm gonna wait for another rank up before I, uh, I move on. Let's not use that cleanse just yet. I'm gonna wait for another rank up so we can do another level 3. One, I couldn't see anything, but true, that damage was terrible. What was that? What was that damage? Um, I still have to see this every single time. I am concerned now. Okay. Maybe I should go back to the SR Liz. Actually. He's doing way more than uh, my characters can tank. I'm gonna rank up Glocks because I need to heal. And then do this. Now I get the melee ultimate. I can't debuff him. So I can't actually like uh, do the triple damage. But it is what it is. He can't seal me because I have a debuff card. So at least that. I got first ramping up. My melee is getting stronger. We should still do decent. That's like 578 multiplier. That's more than level 3. So we're not going to do triple damage, unfortunately. But the Living King is actually... I thought uh, I was going to get slapped around by like the first two. And then I'll, I'll just get, you know, clean house with the others. But this is uh, turning out to be different. Okay. Uh, I don't want to use the Yaffer AoE. Like I said, I want the damage to come from them. Alright, that's better. I still could, couldn't see anything but the Demon King's crotch, but uh, the ultimate did good. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so for what I could tell, I suppose, uh, he heals if he uses buffs. So I shouldn't use uh, Glox's level 3. I swear it hits harder from time to time. Okay, do single targets or Melly's dead. I need Liz. Glox does not cut it. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my original plan of Liz. Uh, Glox does not cut it. I need the extra HP. Right, so I actually swaps to the green Liz. Um, for the green DML, it doesn't matter, but uh, she does have cleanse. So I'm gonna. I plan on utilizing that. So let's alter with Mali. I'm not gonna alter with Liz because I actually do plan on cleansing. Then attack with her. Okay. Yeah. Green Liz has been crazy good because of her relic uh, on dogs. So I was like. Listen, if she can do dogs, she can do this this, <laughs> this story mode fight. Uh, although, I don't really have much damage. I could kill, I think, with Galfer attacks. Realistically. I think the attacks I have could kill. Should I just give Melly this? Let, let's see. I think these will kill. Oh, maybe not. Liz, Liz hitting harder. No, Liz. <laughs> no, she hits harder. I mean, she has double the multiplier as a single target. Does this kill Melly? It does not. Okay, the extra HP is clutch, especially because you you heal more with the healing card set. Uh, if you have more HP related stats. Which Liz is providing. That's not Melly, is it? I don't care. I'll, I'll take. I'll take it as a Melly. Though that that was just unfortunate. Of course, he 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 single targeted Melly there. Of course he did. Out of the three green units, he chose Melly. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Liz, for the win. All right. So I thought that the the true next stop should be the true lost veins because they're gonna be basically the same. They're gonna be uh, ult rush pushing. I think this Lost Vein will be worse because his cards are just straight up worse. Uh, but let's let's do this, right? Let's do this. His cards are worse. I mean, he, he gets the ultimate gauge turn one, so we're gonna actually be able to ult here. But I'm not I'm not very sure if we're gonna be able to actually kill here with the ultimate. Uh, we'll see. But his cards are way worse. So that's why I went. Now that I know that there's no type. Like, the, the type is neutral. Uh, I guess it doesn't... I was going to put him first regardless, but it doesn't really matter 
uh, on that regard anymore. It's just his cards are worse. So let's um, so ult. I guess I'll rank him up. And uh, or, uh, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll ult. I'll rank up Gaffer and then rank up everyone. I think that's better. Could have combined the Gaffer cards, but. That did decent. Okay, next turn we kill. We can cleanse and then kill, I think. Let's see. What's the multiplier on this? 450. Yeah, I think we cleanse and kill next turn. Unless he one shots me. He wouldn't, would he? Okay. Okay. Calm down. <laughs> Calm down, bro. We're good. Would level three have killed me? Not so sure. I, I'm, just, I'm just gonna go. I have faith in him. He's gonna kill. I'm not even gonna bother cleansing. Yeah, good, good debuff. Good job, good job. Or actually, given the performance of the last, uh, you know, lost vein, I'm gonna go with Red and Melly next. I was gonna put Red and Melly like pretty high because I again thought that typing did matter, but because it doesn't, uh, I had to tone him down, tone him down quite a bit. I think on the rankings, maybe uh, he should go down below Green DML. Maybe not. No, 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 not below Green DML. Green DML is worse for this, for this specifically. Um. Oh no, now. I think the last vein I just did probably better because of the ult rush. It's fine, it's fine. The ult from this melee is also <laughs> not gonna be the best, but at least, right, I, I can actually use Red Liz here because we have debuff cards. We ha I mean, th this one at level one is an attack card, but for the most part, I wanna say that I'll probably use it as a debuff card, so. Uh, don't need the cleanse. I can just use the, the mega heal from Liz. Cause like I take the ult here, right? Then I heal from the card set. As soon as he, it's this unskippable ultimate. <laughs> uh. Then the following turn, Liz just basically full heals me. Like her heal is insane now with the with the holy relic. It's crazy. Yeah, look at Galfer. It's like full healed. Um, damn, okay, 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 I got melee ultimate, melee ultimate, I'll full heal, make sure that I actually full heal, just in case, although I think I'll be alright, shock is a terrible debuff, it's like 30%, so the, the damage the shock would do is not too bad, yeah, that's, that's not too bad, we'll be okay, he's not ulting again, so we'll be okay, melee should kill, I got like no cards for him, this whole time, but melee should kill, I, I believe, shouldn't be a problem, Okay. Come on. Uh, crit? Uh, if he doesn't kill, surely the Liz level 3 will do the job. Huh? How you missed that crit? Ah, uh, we don't die here, do we? <laughs> we don't die here, do we? <laughs> Melly, Melly, how can you do this to me? You gotta be kidding me. Shame on him. What, what was that, bro? It, he just had to crit. That like garbage blue Melly got a crit off with his AOE, right? Not the card that increases the uh, the chance. The AOE. And my mans couldn't do it to me. Or couldn't do it for me. Um, you know what? I think that I'm just gonna do this. The next turn, open up as much space for melee cards as possible. And then ult. I think that's the best thing I can do. Hopefully we'll get one melee card. <laughs> at, at least. Um, yeah, we'll attack here. You know, I'll move. 
Sure. We'll get like one melee card, right? So we can get three for the damage increase. Okay, good, good. See, not knowing that he... <laughs> See, this is, this is what happens when I have to play a, the JP version, right? If I could play the glow version. Okay, I, now I'm not so sure. Melee took like no damage from this ultimate. Okay, it's fine. Um, let's do this. I'm gonna rank up Melee, then attack with him, because the attack still counts for the damage. Yeah, this should be a kill. Huh? Okay. It's <laughs> fine. That's okay. He's still better than the blue one, because again, the blue one just has terrible cards, uh, especially damaging wise. Regardless of typing. I mean, these days, I would say the blue one is overall better than this one. Because in the whole spectrum of the game, these cards are terrible, right? Like, damaging-wise, they do more damage in the cards than the other guy does. The other Lost Way Meliodas. Our next stop is Assault Melee. And I mean... <laughs> uh, you can debuff him, but I'm gonna get the stacks for the... Uh, the passive, right? So I went ahead and of course I took out Green Galfer, I took out Liz. We're gonna be doing <laughs> We're gonna be doing this here. Let's waste this. Melaska is giving stats. So she's like she's a, a bad unit, she's never gonna be doing any damage, whatever. But she's giving Melly the stats. So she's like a, the equivalent of Galfer. And we got no melee cards, that's just great. That's just great. Um Hmm, do I want to attack now? I think I will. I think I will. I have to. Let's attack now. Um, no, let's do AoE. Mm, single target now. I'll cleanse and shield. Okay, that's good damage. See, if I, if I don't get shafted on melee cards, like, his single targets do good damage. Like, because, you know... I'm amplifying and stuff. I should have shielded first and then done the uh, single target. That was a mistake on my part, because then I would have had an extra buff for the amplify, but it's fine. It will be okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Uh... Oh, wait. He does heal anytime I... I uh... <laughs> Is it when I have a buff or when I use a buff card? Let's do this. I'm getting really shafted on the melee cards, but... A single target at least will do decent damage. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. The AoE, not so much. Bro! <laughs> that's not his fault. I'm just actually getting so shafted. Is he gonna attack to me as well? Okay. Fine. I'll attack with Glocks first, because then I, can, I think Melee can finish. Awful, <laughs> awful RNG. We'll be okay though. This will finish it off. It will not actually. Could the game just not have given me a single target? Like, would it be so hard? Again. <laughs> like, I got the ult, but like, again, no single target. It's super long ultimate, that's fine, don't care about my last clue. Could not care less. I'll ult of him. Mm -hmm. I wonder if end of year will be a... Uh, purgatory Meliodas. Since we got the Purgatory stuff now, in the story. That'll be interesting. I make no mistake, I didn't forget about Connor Melly. I wanted him to go here now. Because uh, we're gonna obliterate with Connor Melly. See, when he ults, he does a shit ton of damage, alright? And then he follows up with an attack. So, the turn that he's gonna ult, I'll put up the level 3 counter. He's gonna do a ton of damage. The follow-up attack, 
the level three counter kills. Easy, easy, easy. It's exactly how it's gonna go. So, um, hmm. Would it have been wise to put Tarmiel Link on Melee? He might die, actually. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Just in case, so he's doing level one, level three. Just in case, we're gonna heal, so he has full health. And then we're gonna put up a counter. <laughs> Just in case. Okay. This should work. If it doesn't, I'll feel very sad. But this should work. How much damage is it doing here? Chameli. Oh, he did way less than I expected. But he's not gonna do... <laughs> Okay, that's on Melly, isn't it? Flawless plan. Flawless plan, I'm telling you. Telling you, that this is why I kept him now. He might have actually been number one. <laughs> the king of, of uh, one boss, uh, of one enemy type fights. King, actually. No damage caps, only one enemy, no better unit. Alright, so playtime is over, of course. He, uh... He doesn't care about uh, anything other than uh, destruction. Let's, uh, I'm, I'm gonna give him two buffs in the attack. Why not? Let's do this. Could have ranked them up actually, but. <laughs> so, <laughs> think about the level three attacks I've been doing with Demon Melis compared to this one level one. <laughs> that he did. Uh, don't attack you, okay. Yeah, I, I'm just gonna kill now. Yeah. The the difference in power between, between Trader Melee and uh, the other Meliodas is our... Uh, it's very, very large, actually. It's incredibly large, the difference in power. But, with that being said, Counter Melee did very well. He did more damage, actually. <laughs> Color, color Melee unironically did more damage, but yeah. That's all Melee's. Uh, this is pretty nice. Let's see what's gonna be the next boss I'm gonna do this on. Maybe Mael. Because Mael will be a fight. Because, you know, he fights King and stuff in the story, so. Probably gonna have to bring a King, but I'll just bring, like, Skinny King or something. Probably Mael, but we'll see.